Hello everyone, and welcome to my General Hospital News YouTube channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribers button and give this video a thumbs up. According to General Hospital spoilers, Carly Spencer's love life is now unclear, but sooner or later, she might find some closure. Who is the love interest of Carly? Is Carly meant to be with just one man? Though that relationship might already be doomed, it appears that the GH writers are attempting to nudge Carly in the direction of a possible love relationship with John Jagger Cates. John forced Jason Morgan to work undercover for the FBI by pointing to Carly's recio infractions and possible criminal conspiracy charges. Once the truth is out, Carly will likely find it difficult to move past that. Regarding Jason and Carly, they appear to be firmly in the friend zone because they have both expressed satisfaction with the current state of affairs. It seems as though the authors have abandoned all romantic overtones in Carly and Jason's relationship in favor of their close, lifelong friendship, which is exactly as things should be. Naturally, it appears that Carly and Drew Kane are no longer in the picture. Drew was unable to put up with Carly's constant preference for Jason above everyone else, especially because he is currently seeing Nina Corinthos, which would make Carly very angry if she found out. Despite the fact that a lot of people thought Carly and Jack Brennan had genuine connection, he is currently behind bars and working with Valentin Casadoin on a horrible scheme to harm Sonny Corinthos. No matter how many new love opportunities arise, Carly doesn't seem to be able to commit to any of them. Is there a chance that Carly and Sonny would end up together? Carly had earlier pledged to regain what she had lost, and now that she has Jason's help, she is regaining her share of the Metro Court. Perhaps Carly will eventually win Sonny's heart back as well. Regarding Sonny and Carly's broken relationship, things would become worse before they get better, but Jason found it difficult to accept that their shared love was no longer there. These days, Carly frequently rants about Sonny, and they will soon engage in a heated argument. Nevertheless, Sonny and Carly's relationship has the potential to be entirely repaired in the future. Sonny may calm down and make amends with Jason once he's back on the right medications and discovers a way out of crisis mode. That might be the first move in getting Sonny and Carly back together. Do you believe that Carly's relationship with Sonny is over, or will she eventually find real love with someone else? What do you hope will happen with Carly in the future? According to General Hospital teasers, Carly may make some significant changes to her life in the upcoming months. Stay tuned for further information on any romantic developments. While Jason Morgan's homecoming to Port Charles has been tumultuous, there have also been some poignant moments according to General Hospital spoilers. Fans have had to bring Kleenex when viewing some of Jason's comeback sequences, from his reunion with Carly Spencer to his sons Danny Morgan and Jake Spencer. It turns out that in order to go through some of them, Steve Burton also required a stack. Spoilers for General Hospital, Jason Morgan's unique bond alongside Monica Quartermain, G.H. Teasers claim that although Monica Quartermain is not Jason's biological mother, the two are very close, and she is the only mother he has ever known. Even though Jason hasn't identified as a Quartermain in a very long time and disapproves of the highly corporate nature of most Teas, including his twin brother Drew Kane, he still has a deep affection for Monica. It is therefore not surprising that Steve Burton became teary-eyed during sequences involving Jason and his mom, Monica. G.H. Tears, Steve Burton's eyes got teary. Steve revealed to his G.H. co-worker on Burton and Bradford Anderson's podcast that he nearly left the set because he became so emotional during a scene in which Jason reads aloud a letter from Monica that ends with the words, I believe in you. Steve then understood that he had to remain where he was because he was being honest Leslie and genuine. made a few cameos on GH in the last two years, and even though she did make an appearance in late 2023, Monica and Jason have not had a face-to-face -face reunion since Jason's return. Monica isn't as significant in stories as she once was, and Miss Charlison, who has been on the soap opera for more than 46 years, has more than deserved a break from acting at her advanced age of 79. 
If there is ever an official Jason Monica reunion, fans will have to get ready for it. Have any recent moments with Jason's return made you feel teary-eyed? Post a comment below. To keep up with the action, make sure to watch your favorite ABC soap every day. You can also check CTS frequently for the most recent General Hospital spoilers and updates. Spoilers for General Hospital hint that Harrison Chase and Brooke Lynn Quartermain will tie the knot within the next few weeks. In order to ensure that Chase's father, Gregory Chase, could attend, the date was moved up because ALS symptoms are rapidly deteriorating him. Even the ceremony is being officiated by Gregory. Even though Gregory might be headed for tragedy, Brooke Lynn and Chase want to make the most of their Italian honeymoon while they still can. However, they might discover more than they anticipated, or more precisely, someone they didn't anticipate seeing after deciding to spend their honeymoon in Palm Springs, Chase surprised Brooke Lynn with a significant upgrade. The couple's favorite honeymoon destination is Italy, despite the fact that he had to sell his truck to pay for it. Brooke Lynn will love it there. Although Florence will be their main target, they will also be touring the surrounding countryside. They might even try their luck in France. GH spoilers. Paris was where Spencer Cassadine was last seen. As fans are aware, Spencer Cassadine fell overboard on a cruise while he was in Paris. It's likely that Spencer did as well because the turtle dove he was carrying washed ashore on the coast. Though it's unlikely that he ended up in Italy, it's possible that he managed to make it there after surviving the frigid waters or was saved by an Italian family. While they are abroad, there's a chance that Chase and Brooke Lynn will find Spencer and bring him home. Spoilers for General Hospital. Spencer Cassadine is missed by Trina Robinson. When Spencer went too far in an attempt to prevent Essam Prince from hurting any of them, Trina Robinson was in Paris with him. Trina has a great love for Spencer and doesn't seem to be getting over him anytime soon. For Trina, it would be like an answer to prayer if Brooke Lynn and Chase could find Spencer and bring him home. It's possible that Spencer has changed since the accident. He would have found a route back home if he had remembered his past life. How do you feel? Is Spencer still alive? While they are abroad, will Brooke Lynn and Chase be able to locate him? Is a reunion between Trina and Spencer imminent? Keep an eye on General Hospital, which airs on ABC during the week. You never know what will happen in Port Charles. Remember to return often to our page for all of your General Hospital news, details, and spoilers. Spoilers for General Hospital. Is Willow horrified after discovering Nina and Drew's seductive secret? Thanks for watching if you like this video, so please don't forget to subscribe my channel and don't miss any update.